time. All right, everybody, here we go. We are here on another Tuesday toolbox training night. Um, thank you guys so much for being here tonight. We are going to talk about Sensi Club and how to grow our Sensi Club subscriptions. We have our beautiful guest, Ashley Templin, SSD out of, where are you out of, Ashley? Fredericksburg, Virginia. Fredericksburg, Virginia. That's right. Yep. Okay. So we have um, her with us. She's very passionate about Sensi Club. Um, she was with us last month and she talked about a few things, um, working your business on a budget, basically building a, a business broke and you guys loved her and we invited her back and she's a woman of her word. So she's here back to share with us Sensi Club. So thank you again for being here. And if you have questions, post your questions on the side um, and um, we will go on from there. So I'm gonna go ahead and spotlight and here we go, Ashley, take it over. Woo -woo. Okay, hey everybody. Um, so if you guys don't know me, I am Ashley Templin. I am superstar director of the Flamingo Flock. Um, we are a team based out of um, mostly Virginia, but we have uh, team members in, can't count all my little flamingos on my map over here. I have a map that has all of my states on it, but I think it's at least 30 states now. Um, so I'm here to talk to you guys a little bit about Sensi Club. I am extremely passionate about Sensi Club. Sensi Club is one of the things that is like, the number one way that I get a lot of my monthly income. Um, I do a lot of Scentsy Club, a lot of like local orders, things like that. Honestly, I couldn't tell you guys the last time I did a party, honestly. Um, and I know that that's like mind blowing because so many people preach party, party, party. Um, but honestly, for me, Scentsy Club is the way of the future. I am a full-time mom. So I have my daughter here with me. She's two and a half constantly. Um, she's up my butt constantly. That's the reason my office looks like this. It's because um, my child's stuff is all over the floor. Um, but Scentsy Club for me allows me the freedom to be able to have that passive income that I don't have to work so hard for because it's reoccurring income. Um, it's reoccurring orders that you can kind of take out of your monthly guesstimate for what you want to have as your goal. So first thing I want to talk to you guys about a little bit is what is Scentsy Club? So Scentsy Club, the easiest way to explain it to people and the easiest way that I like to explain it is it's your fragrance when you want it. Simple as that. Um, and the more simple you keep Scentsy Club, the more people who are going to be interested in it. So Scentsy Club is consumable products that are delivered on a schedule that works for your needs. Um, so you can add anything that's a consumable product. So what are our consumable products? Wax, um, light bulbs, air purifier filters, car bars, pods, anything that you use up, essentially. Anything that you use, abuse, and it's done. So not warmers, not um, like tabletop bases, none of our uh, core like products that you keep around all the time. Um, so are there exceptions to things that you can add to Scentsy Club? Yes, um, but wax bars are eligible to be added to Scentsy Club even if they're an LTO um, for as long as they're in stock or if it's been less than 30 days since launch. So you can add any fragrance in a wax bar, including LTOs, but you can't add LTOs that are like scent circles or fragrance flowers in LTO fragrances. So LTO limited time offering fragrances. Um, it has to be currently in stock products to be added to your Scentsy Club. So pretty much anything that's in stock, consumable and available all the time can be added to Scentsy Club. It's easy peasy, lemon squeezy. It's the easiest way to remember it. If it's available all the time, it's pretty sure that you're gonna be able to add it to Scentsy Club as long as it's a consumable product. Um, so when I said your fragrance, when you want it, that's one of the biggest things is how often does it ship? That's always the question I get from a lot of customers. How often does it ship? And it's your fragrance when you want it, not your fragrance when Sensi wants to send it to you or your fragrance when your consultant wants to send it to you. It's when you want it. So when you sign up for Sensi Club, you have the option of getting your, your Sensi Club monthly, bi-monthly or quarterly. So every month, every other month or every three months. Um, do you need to sign up for a specific amount of time? Nope, <clears throat> you can cancel whenever you want, skip whenever you want with the exception of discontinued bars. If you skip your club membership with discontinued bars in it, you get one skip every 12 month period. So one skip every year and it's not calendar year, it's every 12 month period. So if you skip your club, um, you 
cannot skip again without losing all of your discontinued bars. So just kind of keep that in the back of your mind for yourself, your customers. And this will go into <clears throat> um, one of the things I'm going to go over with you guys a little bit later is tracking your Sensi Club customers, their orders, keeping track of all of that so that you have kind of your pulse on what's going on with their club to make sure you're providing that excellent customer service and going that extra mile for them. <clears throat> Excuse me. So what are the perks? Why should somebody sign up for Sensi Club? Um, if you want to throw some of the perks of Sensi Club in the chat, please do. Um, but I'm going to tell you, first of all, like, so you guys in the chat, put some of the perks of Sensi Club for your customers. Put what you know is a perk for your customer to sign up for Sensi Club. Um, but I want to talk to you guys about the benefits of Sensi Club for you. So benefits for you, it is reoccurring PRV. Um, you either have monthly PRV, bi-monthly PRV, or quarterly. Um, you also have the ability to focus on new growth versus keeping customers stocked on their constants. So you have the ability to focus on networking new customers versus always making sure that those same customers are taken care of with their favorites because they've already got it in club. You don't have to worry about making sure that Susie Sally down the street has her bonfire beach every two months because you know she's going to go through six bars in two months. It's easy. She signed up for club. She's already set. She's good to go. Um, and it's additional ways to reach out and spoil your customers. So it's a really good way to keep a rapport with your customers and spoil them because like, as we'll like talk about a little bit point. later, um, your Cincy Club customers, I always say you treat your normal customers like gold, treat your Cincy Club customers like they're your diamonds because they're literally doing all of the work for you and you're reaping the benefits, essentially. They're setting up your club all you had to do was tell them to do it and how to do it. Done. And you're just getting reoccurring PRV from it. It's wonderful. So some of the perks for your customers. Irene said discount. Yeah, that's one of the biggest things and one of the most like drawing things to people for Sensi Club besides the always get my bar program. Um, so perks for your customer. They get 10% off their order once it hits a $30 threshold. So once they get to $30, they get 10% off. So if they added a whiff box, it's automatically 10% off. So it's $27 for the whiff box. Why order a whiff box any other way? It's discounted. Why order it any other way? But Cincy Club, they can get it whenever they want. They can skip whenever they want. They don't have to get it every month. They can get it every other month, every quarter, every six months, whatever is convenient for them. Um, and then once their club gets to $60 or more, they get 10% off and a half price item. And they can choose a different half price item every month. They just have to go in and change it every month. If they don't change it, it stays the same. So if they want to make sure that they get their air purifier filter every quarter and they want to use that as their half price item, they can. You want to know what? It's the only place you can use half price items on a whiff box. Use it on a whiff box. So all the stuff that's in the whiff box, like this month's whiff box has what, a value of like $57? And you can get it half price in Cincy Club. And guess what? It has an LTO and a licensed product in it. And they're not taking away the half off of the, the, the Cincy Club. So you're getting $57 worth of product for 15 bucks with your half price item as your, as your whiff box. Mind blown. It's literally the best. Um, so starting February 1, they also added the Cincy Club referrals and rewards program. So your club customers are not only getting rewarded just for having club uh, things in their, in their account, but they're also getting points for every dollar that they spend. So for every dollar that they spend in their club, they get one point. And those points can be redeemed for money off of future order, um, money off of uh, orders on your website, so on and so forth. Um, and then they have the referral program where if that customer refers somebody else to join Cincy Club, they get two points for every one of their friends' dollars in their club. So it's referral for your customers to essentially work for you. Simple. It's just like asking them to party, except for you're just asking them to refer people to join Sensi Club. Um, so it is less work and more pay. And Miguel brought up one of my favorite points of Sensi Club, exclusives. So Sensi Club is the only place that you can buy bricks outside of the holiday collection right now. So we normally only come out with bricks during the holiday season. So Sensi Club is the only time you can get bricks other than the holiday season. Who doesn't want a gigantic bread of like sugar cookie? I do. I love sugar cookie. Mix it with some cocoa lime it is literally the best. 
Um, so now we've gone over the um, perks of Scentsy Club. I absolutely love that I don't have to work. It's more money, less work. It's the best. Um, so let's talk about how to maximize your reach with Club. So I think one of the biggest things with Scentsy Club and reasons that people don't promote it as much is the fact that um, it's one of those things where it's hard asking people to commit to something versus just asking them to purchase a product. So we always preach join host buy, or at least I do on my team, join host buy. If you offer the join opportunity to your customer and they say, no, okay, that's fine. Would you like to host a party and get some of it for free? No. Okay. That's fine. Well, your order, your total is 3159 with tax for your six pack wax. Thank you. Um, but when we throw a Scentsy Club in there, we're doing them a disservice if we're not offering them a discount on the products that they're already consistently buying. So just as we say we're doing them a disservice by not asking them to join, we're doing them the same disservice by not asking them to sign up for Scentsy Club. And it may take that like psychological seven times of hearing you tell them you need to sign up for Scentsy Club for them to actually do it. But I promise you, as we all know, if you have a club membership, once you get your foot in the door, it's all downhill from there. Your club membership just grows. It does. It's very rare that we all get bring or uh, always get my bars and take those always get my bars out because we don't want to lose them. It's like a little child that we can't get rid of. Um, so let's talk about ways to maximize your reach with club uh, and different ways to reach out to people about Sensi Club. LTO promotion. So your limited time offering promotions. Your, those fragrances are available to add to club for up to 30 days past their launch date. So if you launched a brand new fragrance on May 1, that was an LTO, you can add that LTO for 30 days past May 1. Um, so just kind of like keep that in the back of your mind. And even if it makes things simpler for you and what I do as well, um, when we have a new release launch for an LTO fragrance, I always add onto my calendar, um, the day, the last day for it to be added to Scentsy Club. And the other thing is, is when I'm promoting the products, I always put on the promotion that, um, if you're a Scentsy Club customer, make sure you add it to Scentsy Club and the last day to add it is such and such day. So that way you can make sure that if your club customers don't necessarily want to purchase the full like product or pay shipping or get in on a local order, they can just add it to their next club subscription. Um, so you can use that to your advantage when it comes to your club customers. Um, you can sample your LTOs and then encourage your customers to add their favorites to a club membership before the 30 day mark. Now, the caveat to that is, is you got to make sure if you want to use those products as samples and sample those out, you have to make sure that you get your order in for your product to be able to sample them um, as soon as they launch. So you can get them in your hands, sample them and get them out to your customers before that 30 day mark. You want, don't want to dilly dally if that's going to be like your goal and your tactic on uh, sharing LTOs. Um, but like I said earlier, one of the other things you can do is, is if a customer is interested in trying it, um, and they're like, oh, I'd really love that Little Mermaid bar, but I don't have any other things I need to add to an order, but they've got a club membership. Just tell them, hey, add it to your club order. The next time your club order comes, um, try it out. If you don't love it, take it out of your club. Simple as that. And if you do love it, keep it in. You can keep it in for as long as you want or forever. It's up to you. Um, so that's like one of my favorite ways to get people to kind of get, not really get around the shipping, but get around the shipping. <laughs> um, Two other times that you can maximize your reach with club. First one is bring back my bar. So we'll have bring back my bar voting, I think again in June. Um, so bring back my bar fragrances are voted back by customers and consultants. Therefore they're fan favorites. So I'll be to the rescue with some water. So they're fan favorites. Um, you can run a report on your workstation to see who voted what fragrances back or who, yeah, he is a great hubby, um, or who has purchased the returning fragrances in the past. So reach out to those people um, and encourage them to sign up for club because if they sign up for club, then they're gonna be able to have those fragrances forever. They're not gonna have to worry about losing those fragrances again. Um, you can also sample your Bring Back My Bar fragrances with intention. We talked about doing things with intention when we talked about building your business broke, right? We don't just purchase the Bring Back My Bar fragrances, um, to have on hand. We purchase them to do something with them. Um, and whether that be sampling them or having people smell them, 
Um, but get them in the hands of those who already have a club or those who have expressed interest in the sense, because those are your people who you could say, Hey, I know you love this fragrance. It's only available for 30 days, unless you join Scentsy Club, then you can add it to your club subscription and then it'll be available forever. Um, catalog transition time is always my absolutely favorite time to push hard on Scentsy Club. Because two times a year when we transition from fall to winter to spring to summer and vice versa, um, you can reach out to your customers who have purchased fragrances that are on the discontinued list and get them to start a club membership, especially those ones who like, I'm um, trying to think of one right now, Bonfire Beach always goes in my club at the end of this catalog season. Um, and um, Magnolia Linen. Coco Lime, like all of those spring and summer scents that I'm gonna be real disappointed if they don't come back next spring and summer. I add to my club at the end of the spring and summer catalog and I take out my fall and winter fragrances that are returning. It's the cycle of club, the cycle of club and teach your customers to cycle your club. It's the easiest way to always make sure that they keep their fragrances. And it always makes sure that you're keeping your pulse on what they love and what they don't love. What they really could stand to lose and what they, absolutely can't live without. So yes, educate them. Educating your customers is the best way to have consistent customer return because they know that you're educating them to take care of them, not educating them to like make them feel uneducated. You're educating them to make sure that they know they're like the absolute best way to be a Scentsy customer. Uh, yeah, Rainbow Sherbert, it's a good one. My mom has that one in her club in the winter too. And my mom is like one of my biggest clubs. Um, so if you don't have your own club, raise your hand. If you have your own club or put in the chat, if you have your own club, if you have your own club, that's the easiest way to market it. You want to know why you should start your own club? One, you know how the interface works. You know how to go on and add products to your club. You know how to go on and add, um, to change things on your club. Yes. Have your own club. If, um, if you don't know how it works, how are you going to be able to tell your customer how it works? How are you gonna be able to tell your customer when they have a problem with their billing information and need to change their card because their card expired? How are you gonna be able to walk them through it and tell them step-by-step, step, here's how you, change your club, how you change your card on your club subscription. You go this, 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 and this. Or even better, you could actually take and screen record. And guess what? They're gonna see what's in your club when you screen record. So they're going to see, oh, look, look what she's got in her club. Her club's kind of astronomical. My club ain't so bad. So it's the best. Um, but make sure you have your own club. Share every single month that you get your club what comes in it. Because you want to know what? You're going to create that FOMO. Every time somebody sees that you've got Shimmer in your Scentsy Club and they don't have Shimmer in their Scentsy Club, they're going to be real sad. That's what happens to me every month. I have a customer who messages me every month. So sad I didn't add shimmer and so sad I didn't add coffee tree. And I'm like, sucks to suck because <laughs> you're not taking them from me. <laughs> coffee trees for hubby, shimmers for me. Um, but share the perks, share the ease and the affordability. Literally, they are going to be saving money on club because what, what they're going to do is they're not going to have to stock up at the end of the season. They're not going to have to buy 10 bars to get them through the fall season with, of Bonfire Beach because they absolutely love it. They're going to be able to get it one or two bars every couple of months. So it kind of spreads those things out, makes it a little bit more affordable. Um, like I said earlier, the whiff box. Scentsy Club is the only place that you can get a discounted whiff box. If you add it to a club membership, it's automatically 10% off. So it automatically puts you at that $30 threshold. So it brings it down to 27 bucks. And then on top of that, if you get to the $60 threshold on your club membership, you could add your whiff box as your half price item. It's the only place you can get your whiff box discounted. And if you are looking, ever looking to build stock or like have on hand product or want something really good to share with your customers or split and use for samples, that's the best way to do it. Getting the whiff box half price in your club is the best way to do it. Because like I said, this month's value of your club membership not only is the, the Whiff Box um, all summer collection scents, but it's all summer collection scents in different fragrance uh, collections. So it's body, it's clean, it's fresh, it's, um, sorry if I'm spoiling it for y'all, <laughs> but wax. You're getting a little bit of everything in the Whiff Box this month. Plus you're getting that snuggly little limited 
um, limited time only Star Wars collection item. So the value is $57. And if you're getting it half price or even getting it for the 10% off at the $27, the value is still there. You're still really already getting it half price. So you're able to get it significantly discounted to be able to use it to market even further. So um, let's talk about setting some goals. So um, she's a weeby club. <laughs> it's okay. Um, I have stickers that go on my club boxes every time I mail out something to my Scentsy Club customers that say everybody in the club getting Scentsy and it's the best. Um, but uh, set some goals for Scentsy Club. So I want you to kind of think about a couple of things. How many club memberships do you currently have? Number one. Number two, how many would you like to have by the end of 2022? And we always talk about setting SMART goals. So uh, realistic, attainable, time, uh, SM, yeah, SMART. Y'all know what a SMART goal is. Uh, <laughs> uh, I could share the sticker with you. I made it myself. Um, but anyways, uh, set a SMART goal. Set something realistic, attainable um, that's on a time schedule, so on and so forth. Don't set, say I want to have 500. Don't say I want to be a Lisa Roberry by the end of 2021 or 2022, because you guys, it's probably not going to happen. Lisa has built a very strong organization for what she has with Scentsy Club. She is a queen at Scentsy Club. Um, I would literally love to like be in her mind on Scentsy Club, um, but set an attainable goal for what you want by the end of 2022. If you have five club subscribers now, double it and say, I'd like to have 10 by the end of 2022. I think that that's attainable. I think that that's a smart goal. Um, if you have Lisa Roberry, R-O-W-B-E-R-R-Y, you can find her on YouTube. She's literally the queen of YouTube. Um, so, and she has like, I want to say like $12,000 a month in Cincy Club orders. Like she's, she's literally amazing. I think that she's uh, amazing. So um, set an attainable goal for what you want to have by the end of 2022. The other thing is, is in what ways are you planning on sharing Scentsy Club? What ways do you currently share Scentsy Club? How often are you sharing Scentsy Club? Start thinking about Scentsy Club in the same ways that you think about hosting, joining, and buying. So it's no longer just host, join, buy, or buy, host, join. No, yeah, join, host, buy, join, host, buy. Yep, um, it's no longer join, host, buy. It's now join, host, Scentsy Club, buy, because you're doing them a disservice by not offering it to them. Um, and then do you currently have a club membership? I think we have already established that most people in here already have a club membership. Um, but make sure that you're always promoting your club membership. And then the other thing is, is I want you to think about, do you feel comfortable and knowledgeable enough to promote this to your customers? I think that that is one of the number one reasons that people don't promote Sensi Club is they're not comfortable or knowledgeable enough with sharing that with other people. Just like we tell you guys to get comfortable and knowledgeable about the products you're selling, and literally know every single piece of the product you're selling, how it's made, all of those different things, because a well-educated consultant is going to breed well-educated consumers. Being educated yourself is going to make it that much easier for you guys to share the products with other people. So like you guys see how passionate I am about Scentsy Club, it's because Scentsy Club is my baby. So like I could sit here and tell you guys all day long, like, you need a club, you need to have all kinds of club subscriptions. Y'all sit on your couch and watch Netflix and just pour in money from Scentsy Club subscriptions. Like that's the best life, right? That's what we want. We want to set up a long, long living and sustainable business that we can do the things we want to do, like spend more time with our families, not have to work nine to fives if that's our goals. So what are we going to do to do that? We're going to find ways to have consistent income. Scentsy Club is consistent income. Um, Ariel says she gets in trouble with her total on Scentsy Club. No, well, my husband doesn't look at mine. <laughs> no, mine's not that bad. It's under a hundred bucks a month. So I'm, I'm good. I cycle mine a lot. Um, so I want to tell you guys a couple of the different ways that I spoil my VIP, my Scentsy Club VIPs. And I was actually on a training last night with um, Kim White. She came on and trained my team on front loading. And we talked a little bit about happy mail afterwards. And um, I currently am doing themed happy mail monthly for my club subscribers. And I always tell my group, 
um, when we talk about building our business broke, which is the toolbox that we did last time, um, I always tell my group, don't do something just to do it, do something with intention. And I enjoy putting together my themed um, club boxes. But one of the things that I have found is, is I don't get a very big return on in, uh, a return on investment from them. I'm doing a lot of samples and I'm doing a lot of mailing out of cute little tchotchke things for my customers, but I'm not getting anything back when I'm following up with them. I'm not getting um, a lot of repeat orders for the products that I put in those. So you wanna know what? I'm gonna stop doing it. And Kim brought up this really good idea. She says she gives her customers wax cash every month of their club subscription runs in their happy mail, their normal happy mail, like what she sends every customer for a PWS order, she adds $5 in wax cash in there. And they can use that wax cash off of an order and it's good until the end of the year. So it's good until December and they can stack that. So she's like, come December, they may have, if they have 12 club subscriptions, that's what, 60 bucks to use towards an order. But you wanna know what? You've definitely made 60 bucks off their club memberships, guarantee you but it's scalable. Do whatever's comfortable for you. If you want to give them a dollar every time they do their club membership, if you literally just want to send them an extra special thank you note after they do their club membership, whatever way you can find to spoil your club customers, that's a little one step beyond what you do for your normal customers, because you want to know why your regular customers are gold, absolutely gold. They pay your paycheck. They support you. They're returning, returning customers. Your Scentsy Club customers are diamonds because your Scentsy Club customers are the ones who are consistently, consistently seeing your, adding your PRV. So um, I send them monthly club mailers to anybody who's club that ran. Um, normally I try to make sure that they have exclusive samples of LTO products when they're accessible. Um, I give them first looks at any of the personal specials for the upcoming months. So I do monthly scent crates. That's something that I like, I will never give up. Absolutely love doing. Um, I Ashley, do can you, Ashley, can you hold one second? Sakima, yeah. can you please mute your mic? Um, it's not allowing me to mute you and it's coming through that way we can hear Ashley. Thank you, girlfriend. Where is it? Will it let me do it? Nope, I don't think so. You want me to go ahead? Yeah, I, I, it's Perfect. not letting me mute her on my own. I don't know why, but usually does. But yeah, go for it. I think she got it. Okay, okay. cool. Um, so your Cincy Club customers are your diamonds, but I always give them first looks on personal specials for the upcoming month. So if I plan on doing like a stock sale or something that um, I can... Um, share and one-on-one, -on -one, I will share that in their happy mail. As a Sensi Club customer, they get access to all kinds of extra things. They're like your VVIPs. They're like your very, very important people. They're extra special to you. So um, focusing on Sensi Club can take the guesswork out of where your baseline PRV is coming from each month. So we always talk about front loading, right? We talk about front loading your month so you don't have to think about, um, you don't have to think about where your PRV is coming from. So front loading your month means pretty much figuring out what your goal is for the month. So like my goal is always 2K every month. I know I want to have $2,000 in sales at least. So what do I need to do to get that 2,000? If I look at where my reoccurring income is coming from, I know that out of that 2,000, this one month, I have $100 in Sensi Club memberships that run. So then I only have to worry about 1900, right? Because I have that $100 in club memberships that's nine times out of 10 gonna run. I just have to make sure I keep my, my fingers on their pulse to make sure that their club membership runs properly and that there's no issues with it. Um, but I know that that's PRV I don't have to work for. Makes things a little easier on your front loading. So then you can say, okay, well, I have to come up with 1900 PRV for next month. Let me figure out where that's coming from. I've got a party here, 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 and here. I've got this here, here. You can kind of make a game plan and a roadmap, but it, it takes a little bit of that pressure off of that goal for you to have that little padding from your Sensi Club subscribers. subscribers. Um, so reasons to start your own club. We talked about a little bit. You learn the interface. You educate yourselves on products that can be added and when. You have something to show your customers each and every month, and you don't lose your own favorite bars. 
So you're creating that FOMO with your customers who are going to see that you got that shimmer or that bonfire beach when it was no longer available. So let's talk about who will benefit from starting a club. Um, any of your customers who order the same products over and over and over and over and over again, i.e. your clean customers, your pets, your laundry, your customers who um, like um, pods, things like that, because they can only get them from us. So your customers who order the same products over and over again, your whiff box lovers, anybody who likes a mystery, literally the easiest way to figure out who that is is posting your VIP group and be like, hey, who likes a mystery and a discount, dot, 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 because you want to know what they're going to want to know what you're talking about. Really for sure going to want to know what you're talking about. Uh, your stockpilers, air quotations, the people who are afraid that their favorite fragrances aren't going to come back. Um, your old school peeps who are like, hey, I need 20 bars of something, 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 because it's not coming back in the spring. Those are the people you're going to be like, look, I love you. And I'm going to need you to sign up for Cincy Club right now. Here's the link. Just do it. Thank me later. Um, your cotton cleanup users. Y'all, for the longest time, cotton cleanups were only available in club. Only available in club. Do you want to know what? Even now that you can order them catalog, how many of you guys are selling cotton cleanups outside of catalog? Probably uh, outside of club. Probably very few people are selling cotton cleanups outside of club because most of the people who bought them put them in their club because they couldn't live without them. So the people who can't live without cotton cleanups, AKA Scentsy tampons, that's what I call them. That's what my customers call them. Um, get them to add them to their club. My customers know that my, my cotton cleanups, I hoard them things. They ain't going nowhere. They ain't going nowhere. Um, and your, excuse my language, shit I ran out of blank peeps. So your people who are always running out of laundry, AKA me, your people who are always running out of a certain fragrance that they love, your people who are running out of such and such, because you want to know what, if they put it on a schedule, set it and forget it. They're never going to, they're never going to run out again. Never going to ever run out of it again. And the other people who benefit from a Scentsy Club is you. You will benefit from your own Scentsy Club because you get paid back on it. You have something to market and you have easy ways to share the products because you can use them for samples. You can create that FOMO. You can have something to showcase every single month. Any of you guys who are scared to go live, any of you guys who are scared to delve into Instagram, any of you guys who are scared to delve into stories, easiest way to do it is with your Scentsy Club. Literally unbox your Scentsy Club every single month. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Um, let me check on chat and see what I missed um, because I had to turn it off because I was swirling. Working on getting regular customers to club members, that's where I'm struggling. Keep at it. The biggest thing that I will always tell everybody is psychologically, it takes seven times of seeing something before it sticks in somebody's brain. So it will take seven times of you showing them the benefits of Scentsy Club and how it will benefit them before they actually are like, okay, you're not just trying to like blow smoke up my butt. Um, but the other thing is, is every single time you send out happy mail or, um, orders, packaging orders, things like that. Um, and I will share these resources with you guys. I don't have printed ones of my new ones, but every time you do, you send out orders um, for customers or happy mail, make little postcards like these ones. And I'll share the template with you guys in the group. Um, but I have two different templates. One says uh, new Scentsy Club referral program. And the other one says join the Scentsy Club. And the one that says join the Scentsy Club has all the perks of Scentsy Club on it. Add those to every single order. Add them to, and you can literally even print these at home, y'all. Like I just get them printed because I'm lazy. Um, but add these to your order. Um, every single order that goes out. Add join Scentsy Club, blah, 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 blah. Anytime a club membership goes out, make sure you give them information on the referral program because I promise you they're not utilizing it and they should be because it's just money back for them. Um, yeah, Roseanne said, I concentrated on promoting Cincy Club for a week and was able to get six new members. Whoop, whoop, that hyper focus. I love it. Um, yes, double your Cincy Club by the end of the year. Um, yeah, I will share 
um, my templates for these. I have them saved. Um, obviously, these are my branding, like anything tropical neon is all brand, like everything's flamingo related. Um, but I will share all of my templates. Um, so if anybody has any questions, I am free to answer them for you. Does anybody have any questions for Ashley um, in regards to anything Sensi Club? I know somebody mentioned verbiage. I think, you know, she's covered that, but if you want to elaborate a little bit on that, you're welcome to. Um, do you have any questions about, um, I know, I think somebody asked about rewards or did I make that up? I might've made that up. <laughs> um, and the perks of it, she did say she'll share the template, which is awesome. So we'll get that in the group after. But does anybody want to ask a question? You can unmute yourself um, if you'd like to. Let's see. I know for my uh, Sensi Club, I, I was almost at $1,000 a month. And then a couple of my teamies joined. That's why we have to keep re like adding to our club. Because when they join, they take their club with them. And then it's like okay, that goes. And then that goes. So I, I think the month that I was up at a thousand, I think I had two or three teamies. I mean, customers join and they were my big club orders. And I was like, yes, no. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it was a little bit of both. So does anybody have questions for her? Irene, Angie, Ariel, Miguel, Karina, Jessica, Vicky, feel free to unmute yourself if you do. Everybody's being shy today. That just means that I covered everything in so much detail that they just don't need. <laughs> exactly. It's the four pages of notes for me. You guys are welcome. Oh, can you show them your notes? They're so pretty. Look at her notes. <laughs> I do everything on my iPad. Um, so I use my iPad for note taking because I can just carry it with me anywhere. But like it even has little like sticky notes with washi tape on my iPad. Good notes on the iPad. Best investment I ever made for my business. All right. Well, if nobody else has questions, we'll go ahead and wrap up. But thank you, Ashley. This was such helpful information. Um, she will give us a template. She'll put us put it in the squad group. Mm -hmm. And then um, what was I going to say? Remember to add the inserts to every single order. I think that's a huge um point like you can't assume since you put it in once or mentioned it once that they're going to remember oh I remember three weeks ago she mentioned the club like it has to be repetitive and like how she said it takes six or seven times for somebody to actually click like oh this is like a good idea educate your customers um make them feel confident and and in seeing the perks and make them feel confident walk them through if you have to on their join uh, and their club subscription. That way they, they know how to maneuver through there. Um, I think that's it. But uh, yes, I, Ashley, are you in the Let's Freaking Post group? I think so. Maybe okay, if you're if you're not, I can do it, but they would like the template. I invited some of them here. Yeah, yeah. Too. If I, um, let me check. I don't think I'm um, good question. Um, if I'm not, add me and then I can um no I'm not in it but I just requested to join um yeah and then if you could add it there for them too that'd be awesome yes. I'll add both of the um the templates for new Sensi Club referrals for any of your current Sensi Club subscribers and then I have one also for information on um on just plain joining Sensi Club I have one one last thing how would you handle, because somebody just said I have to work on my um, wording, I guess, because they say no. Well, how do you handle like any type of rebuttal or you just kind of put it in the pocket and then later you you reiterate or how do you handle it? Do you, because I, I think it's, some people just say no because they're not educated. They don't understand. Yeah, I think it's all situational. Um, I think it all depends on what's their reasoning for not doing it. I think a lot of people are so afraid of the commitment of a subscription-based service 
So I stop offering it as like, oh, it's a subscription service or it's um, a VIP. If you think about it um, like this, like we all know that there are companies out there who make it seem like you're joining a VIP program with them or you're doing this, that, and the other, but you're actually becoming a distributor. So a lot of people shy away from those things. It's like easiest way to explain it. You go to a store and you go to check out and they're like, Hey, do you have one of our rewards cards? Would you like to sign up today and save 20%? But they're actually getting you to sign up for a credit card. So many people are so afraid that that's what we're offering them, that we're offering them like the opportunity to join or they can't cancel or there's going to be a contract or there's some fine print that's hidden somewhere and there literally is not. It's almost too good to be true that people can't under like wrap their heads around it. So consistently sharing with them really how much it's going to benefit them, not benefit you and that you can cancel for free. It's free. It, it's no additional cost. All you're paying for is um, the product that's in it and then shipping. Literally all it is, is just taking the ease out of having to come see me when you need a refill. That's, that's exactly how I explain it to my customers. Um, somebody asks, is it possible to pause for certain products for the month, but still get the others? No, there isn't. Um, you can pause your whole subscription. You can't pause certain products. And the reason for that is, is we create these products in such limited quantities a lot of the times with them being discontinued fragrances and so on. Um, that they have to be able to bring all the oils and the actual like components in to make these bars that they can't just say, okay, well, you can pause this one this time. You can pause this one that time because they're already prepping for what's coming. Um, but if it's a current catalog fragrance and it's not discontinued, you can take it out of your club before your club ships and then re-add it after that club ships. So that there's kind of a little bit of flexibility with it. Um, yeah. And Ariel said the same thing that uh, I always tell my customers to tell them if that they're interested in an LTO bar, but don't have the money that they can add it to a club. Um, so add it to club so that they save on that shipping. They don't have to place that whole order and pay $8 shipping for one bar. They can just add it to their club subscription. If they love it, they love it. If they don't, they take it out. We can skip the day before. Wow. It used to be 10 days. I thought it was 10 days it's locked. Mm, I'm learning something new. <laughs> All right, well, if that's it, um, we will wrap up with um, Ashley Templin. And um, I will download this into my YouTube um, tonight and then I'll upload and send the link to you, Ashley, and then I'll upload it for uh, both the squad and let's freaking post so that you guys can replay lots of good information to go back over and know, especially posting and VIP and talking how to talk about it with your team, with your customers. So that's good information to go back and review if you don't have it in your notes and those who joined late, you're able to go back and watch from the beginning. So thank you so much, Ashley. I really, really appreciate you coming on and sharing with the group. And- Anytime. Everybody have a good night. We'll talk soon. Bye. Bye.